Good evening and welcome. We are here for a brand new one day special with the lovely Maria. Hello. This is your Clarity <laughs> one day special and we're going to be showcasing Groovy, aren't we? We are indeed. Just in case anyone has not heard of Groovy, just explain because they're part of Clarity, aren't they? Yes, absolutely. Very much this is one of our core products now. So Groovy is uh, a system of etched plates um, so that you can transfer onto parchment the beautiful line art without the uh, the really sort of technical times uh, sort of you know taking process the traditional process to get your line art onto onto parchment so it's tricky. sort of a simpler way yes. of doing your parchment yes. with this system it's taking you one rung up the ladder so that then Fast. once you've actually got the artwork onto your parchment you can do you can you know go in with your comfort zone just leave it white do a little bit of coloring or you can incorporate the traditional techniques as well so it's up to you and it does make it an awful lot easier <laughs> if maybe parchment something you're interested in but you've not quite got into it yet the groovy mm -hmm. system could be for you but first of all we need to talk about our one day special because yes. those of you who already know and love the groovy system will probably know that cherry green did introduce some stamps however they are at the bottom of the screen we are with our one day special today and these are the brand new a6 plates we wish you christmas by cherry green so and you're also getting 10 a4 parchment sheets in your cranberry and your green $29.95 and your PMP item number 037732. Tell me about these plates. Okay, so as you said, we, we previously brought the stamped images. Yes. So they were designed by Cherry Green, who is uh, our, our newest uh, designer. Lovely. Um, these are absolutely beautiful. You know, when we bring out the stamps, we find that people that do groovy and parchment want the same designs yeah. and vice versa. So this is what we've done. Um, so on each of the plates, you've got a beautiful sort of shoe or a boot, and then you've got different accents and embellishments on there as well. Um, and then, of course, you've got the beautiful... Uh, sentiments which are fab the thing is though for me these if you take away the sort of the Christmassy elements these are not just for Christmas no okay? absolutely I agree mm -hmm. with you there yeah. yeah stunning stunning images so let's have a look at a couple of samples oh these are so, obviously the beautiful. design team yeah, yeah always they stunning. do a beautiful job so this is Jane Halford oh I um, love her absolutely gorgeous these are my favorite colors as well so you can see here you know there's no sort of hint of Christmas here at no, all it's just a all. really elegant shoe and the the thing is, you know, us, you know, ladies, regardless of our age, we all wear shoes, don't of we? Of course, so, yes. There you go. This is our Glynis. And again, here, this, you know, there's no shoes here no. at all. So you can see the beautiful feathers there uh, with, you know, in the, the uh, frame and then just using the beautiful wording as well. So um, this then, one, yeah, this is Glynis right. as well. Have I got that the right way up? Yes, you have. Yeah, 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 okay. you have. So what Glynis has done here is that because the wording, I did the same when I went, oh, I'm going Glynis, which yeah. way are we going there? Yeah, no, she's come at the uh, side angle. I love who's that. to say you can't? Exactly. Yeah, there you yes. go. So she's in a couple of the shoes there. Really lovely. Look at that. Karen Jackson, absolutely gorgeous work. So again, you'll see though, you've got a frame with the, uh, the fairy light. So that's just one little strip on the actual plate. That's yes. only one strip. So Karen's put that round and made a, a frame. And I'm going to show how to isn't do that, that, but not pretty. with these ones. Oh, good. Isn't that pretty? Yeah. And then, ooh, gorgeous. Look so at again, this. Linda Page. Now, there you go. How about that? That these is a pair boots of boots, are made for parties. They? Oh, I want those boots. Yeah, Where can I get too. those boots? Mm. Yes, gorgeous. Yeah. So you're right. It's a different way uh, to produce a Christmas card. Yeah. But it's also all year round as well. Like, look yeah. how pretty that is. Absolutely. So stunning, isn't it? Yeah, another one from Linda Page. Okay, doke. Um, then just one more. One I'll show more. you. <laughs> <laughs> this one's our Mrs. Panky. This is Carol. So again, no shoes here. Carol's just built up a lovely kind of um, wreath with the different elements that are on the. the plates and then made up her own sentiment there as well okay um a little bit of news for you we are 10 percent of the one day special stock gone it's a 24 hour stock right. as we know mm -hmm. but 10 percent of the stock has already gone these are brand new today you have loved the stamps the stamps are at the bottom of the screen you've seen those you've loved those these are the brand new plates if this is something you want to buy you need to check out your basket 10 percent of the stock gone on those okay right let's move on 
to something that I own. Indeed yes, you do, you like this, don't you? Yeah, I absolutely <laughs> love this. So this is your Groovy Go. This is your mini starter kit. So you get your plate mate, your A6 plates, your mat, your parchment, your tools and your accessories, 29.94 and your PMP, which is a brilliant price for all this, 495443. So this is something that a very lovely Paul Church gave me for me and my son mm -hmm. to do crafting together because yeah. obviously part parchment um, is great for sort of getting that control you know with the kids and everything mm -hmm. when you're getting that control but it was something that I started to do the parchment and really really enjoyed it but only really because of this system that's right yeah. yeah well this is how a lot of people you know have come to um, you know sort of partner because the traditional way it's very very beautiful but you know there's ladies out there that have taken 10 and 20 years and 30 years in really sort of you know building on those skills yeah so you know it's now available for everybody but we're not trying to replace the traditional techniques we're saying no. use this with we're now kind of putting this on the radar parchment of so many more people so now if you can hold a pen regardless of your age you can now do groovy and then if you want to do parchments as well yeah then then you can do that it's so true and this kit is incredible because you are getting uh, the tool as well mm -hmm. you're also getting your anti-static which is obviously what you use and um, you're getting the plate here but you're getting some lovely little designs yes, these are designed designs. By, uh, by Tina these are Tina's yes. doodle plates so they're you beautiful recognize them, can't but you? the reason that we've actually got this kit actually on the on the counter for for the one day special is because of the size of the plates that we've got in the one mm. in, in the one day special because they are a, a six um, size plates so the aperture the, in the plate mate in the groovy go is um, it will work in that as well so. fabulous and as well as your one day special you can produce an awful lot in here obviously mm -hmm. in the booklet you're getting as well there's ideas there's designs yes. so getting them both you're gonna be busy for a long time very aren't you very much so very much so so your item number is 495 443 29.94 and your pmp such a brilliant price for this now moving along mm -hmm. <laughs> the stamps. So this is why we're here initially, because this is where it all began with these stamps, which you loved. So 515-998-3996, 18 stamps in total. We're thinking over the course of the one day special, we're going to have a bit of a sneak peek at you demonstrating the stamps mm -hmm. at some point, yes. aren't we? But these are so, so pretty. They really are absolutely stunning. The, you know, the, the, the work that's gone into these, you know, there's such fine detail and it's all in there with the stamps. Also within the sets, you've got the masks as well, so that you yes. can, um, you know, do your masking techniques as well. And also for those that um, like to colour, or those that like to colour but maybe don't know where to start, what we've also done is included in here the colouring guide from Cherry herself. So she's actually coloured these. Oh. So you can either go your own way or you can actually follow the colouring guides that actually comes in. Oh, that isn't lovely. that helpful? Because mm -hmm. you're right. I know that's that. You're right. Because you might get these home and think, well, I, I just don't know where to start colouring yeah. wise. There you go. So oh, just how show wonderful. you, you know, maybe where to put them to put the colour darker. Maybe you know where to add a little bit of uh, light. Or as I say, just go your own way completely. This is nice. This is uh, from Sheila. Mm. A lovely tag. So Sheila's actually made a, a pair of shoes here. She's used the baubles as well. So that's pretty cool lovely um, this one's quite nice it's on a watercolor paper this is Jane oh. um, so you can see kind of the blurred uh, outline there yeah. really nice so what Jane's done there is she's introduced a bit of water she's just dye based inks yeah. so that it bleeds out a little bit very cool very funky I was just look. about to say very cool isn't it and yeah. then look at this completely yeah, from different Dee. so Dee has um, she's she's cut the boot out there um, I, these, these boots are marvellous these take me back because I used to wear a lot of these um, kind of Boots. Yeah, they're yeah, fabulous, so, aren't yeah, they? Beautiful piece. Um, and then here, completely different colourway, um, Elaine Milner. Um, beautiful look at that so what uh, Elaine's done here we've got the the focal of the boot uh, and then we've got the uh, wording as well which is very very cool yes um, I think that may be offered as an option so it is on the so your stamps the details 515-998-3996 and your PMP and there's a freedom price on these stamps as well 35.96 including your PMP now we do have some sentiment stamps hmm. that will be your um, end of call offer so when you make your purchase when you check out these are actually going to pop up as an option for you to purchase 
So I'll read those out actually, I'll read them from here. So we wish you a Merry Christmas, peace at Christmas, health, wealth and happiness and Happy New Year and then a wishing you as well. Yeah, so so basically, perfect mix sentiment. Mix and yeah, match. Exactly. You know, these really, they, they, were, they were made to go with these shoes, yeah. but they're not just for these shoes. They're just really nice sort of fonts and they're quite priced. Yeah, perfect. So that you can check that out when you go to your end of call offer. So your stamps again, 515998, two payments on Flexi of 1998. But I know you want to see some demonstrations. Before that, why don't you have a look at some inspiration? Well, we're approaching 20% of mm -hmm. the one day special stock gone. She's not surprised. She knew it was going to happen. Yeah, I mean, it's lovely. Really yeah, is. I know. We yeah. knew it was going to be really, really busy. Mm. Uh, but this is exceptionally busy. But anyway, let's get down to some demonstrations. Okie dokie. Right, so this is where we're going to head towards. How much of it we're going to get done, I'm, I'm not completely sure. So what we decided, it was very strange. I thought about when we try to pack lots and lots in, mm. in the shows, and it gets a little bit manic. Whereas the idea of group and parchment is to just relax and just yes. ensure you'll know yourself now you've had to go it's very relaxing oh, isn't it? there's nothing like yeah, it yeah so I decided we weren't going to do the panicking bit we're going to get done what we get done and it's really strange because I was on the phone to Barbara um, we were both on hands free um, on the way here and um, and she's very much in the same if you go and look at Barbara's blog today um, and she's talking about the slowing down just the enjoying the process yeah. and the mindfulness of it all um, and we were like we we're really we're in the same sort of uh, zone together this yeah. week we really Oh yeah, so, but there's yeah. just it's just I don't know what it is, but it just de-stresses it everything. Does. It just it's so enjoyable. Relaxing. It's the first thing that people say to us. So that's kind of going to be the idea over the Lovely. next 24 hours. And tomorrow we're gonna we're even gonna sit down and have a little and, and chill oh, tomorrow as well. How so wonderful. yeah, it'd be nice. We're gonna do some relaxing. So um, what we've got here is a couple of different layers. Okay. Uh, we're gonna use some clear parchment, and we're also gonna use some uh, pattern parchments as well. All right. So I think what we'll do, we will start with the the border piece. Okay, first okay. of all. So, because I want to show a little tip um, with the uh, with the plate using the regular plate mate, okay, which comes in the deluxe, the regular starter kit. So, what you'll notice is with the plates, here we go. So, with the plates, as I say, these ones are actually A6, okay, okay rather than our original uh, A5 square. So, what you'll see is that we've got this gap. All right. Yes. Now we have spaces um, that fill those gaps for people who want to just use, you know, the A6 plates, different size plates within this set. That's fine. Okay. But I'm actually going to use it as it is because I want to just show a little technique. Okay. okay. Just to make you aware that if you wanted that starter kit, which is what Maria's using, 587104 details are on the screen and that is everything that you're getting included. So you get an awful lot. 49.99 your PMP mm. and you can spread it on flexi. Okay, dokey. Right, so all I'm going to do here, uh, I'm going to put the parchment that way, aren't I? Okay, let me find my, get my bearings. So I'm sticking the parchment down with uh, groovy tabs. Okay, so these are in the accessory uh, pack, which is on the website. So you get the uh, pack of the groovy tabs. You also get a groovy guard, which I'm about to use as well. Yeah. And you can top up your parchment because there's a full pack of 20 parchments in there we'll as well. Bring the details okay. up for you. Something to mention as well. If you've got any questions for Maria while she's here, please email us mm. studio at tachanda.com or any pictures 
images you'd like to show her, please feel we'll free. We'd love to, yeah, yes. that'd be really nice. Right, okay, so I'm going to start with the, you can see I've built up a frame, mm -hmm. okay? So that's where I'm going to start. So I'm going to use my one millimetre uh, Pergamano embossing tool. If I was using my tools from the starter kits, I would be using tool number one. Um, now don't worry about that too much if you just kind of taking the plunge today and you're gonna buy one of the starter kits don't yeah. worry it's all in your instructions it will guide you through yeah. um, the uh, the instructions that tell you what tool to use at what point also everything that Maria is using will be on our website just mm -hmm. to make you aware so if you're also as well watching on rewind check out the website all the different tools etc um, she will be on just shop by brand there we go. So what I'm doing, because what I've got here is kind of these little grooves, okay? So by pressing on the grooves is how I'm managing to stay within the tracks, if mm. you like, rather than having to kind of trace this freehand. Because if I was doing that, and I know from experience that tracing it freehand, the traditional way, you know, takes quite a, a time. Um, it's also, it's not as accurate. Um, I found that I would get sort of halfway through and put my, my tool straight through the, the parchment there was just lots of you know sort of things that would trip me up mm. all right so with this we can just give it a nice press and glide around okay so what I'm gonna do now uh, quite simply I'm just gonna flip this around I'm leaving my parchment in place and I'm just flipping that round like so okay and then I'm gonna come in and I'm gonna do the same down the bottom okay I can feel that dragging a little bit so I'm gonna give that another now this is I just the... need to mention my literally favourite obsession which I do talk about on every groovy show and that is oh. this light box yes because I also have a light box Maria oh I don't mean to show off but I do have a light box as well wow. um and to me it's a world of difference mm -hmm. yes you can see what you're doing without your light box but it makes life so much easier as we yeah. can see now with Maria using that it just makes it easier sort of more enjoyable to use you see exactly what you're doing yeah. so we've got the details for that on the screen and of course it you, you get the cover and you get the piercing mat as well you do you? yeah you do indeed um, as you say you know it's a great piece of kit it's not essential but it's very desirable and once you've used yeah. it you think, oh yeah now I see why I need it it's particularly good if you're going to use colored parchment because it's trickier to see through colored parchment because yeah. you've got color there haven't you um, also what it's really good for is um, what I use it for a lot it, it actually fits on um, a lap tray so um, I can actually sit in the evening um, and if the lamps on low in the living room so I can you know still be sociable with the family that's but nice, I can still do it? this as well mm. you see so that's where it's really good for me right here we go so I've done the top and bottom and then all I'm gonna do now is just come up the side and then up the other side, same, I'm just literally rotating the plate around, okay? Yeah. So then what I would get is this piece here, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, so now I've got a square frame. Yeah. So we're gonna move on from that one. So let's do some other things. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to say goodbye to my regular plate mate for the moment. I'll yes. put that on the bottom of my uh, little pile over here. And I'm gonna come in and start using the, uh, the groovy go, okay? So this is the plate mate that comes with. Now, I'm actually lucky enough to also own, and this is on the website as well, this is the cal calligraphy plate mate. Mm. Now this one, if I explain, uh, the Groovy Go plate mate will sit in it because we also have plates within as we've grown the collection all right we'll come up with different size plates so this would be our a5 rectangle plate you see we've got those you know nested shapes and that sort of thing so I'm lucky enough to have that so I'm going to use it however if I was going to do this without then yeah. all I would need to do because we need to secure the parchment down to something yeah so I would just trim my parchment a little bit where I can so that I've then still got somewhere to see I, c I can tape it here and here with my, yes. my groovy tabs that's fine it's just that because I am a little bit spoiled and I know a lot of people out there have invested in this so just to show that, that might be an idea as well just so you make it yes. right so okay do you use it or don't use it it's up to you so okay. that will be on the website for you 
Rightio. So let me just have a little look at my plates in here because I've changed my baubles ever so slightly. So I want to just show that. Right, here we go. So this plate here, I'm going to turn this around so it's easier for me. Um, so here we've got this lovely sort of border. Now this is great for actually building up a frame as well. Mm. You could do the same pretty much as what I've just done. Um, so what we've got, see these kind of little sort of snowflakey, uh, sort of starbursty type shapes on there. I think they're really, really cool for embellishing bits and bobs. So what I did was I used one of those in my bauble. So here we go. So let's have a look. There we go. Like so. And then I've just popped that in place. Like so. Okay. Have I got them all? I think I have. I can always go back if I haven't. So just rotate your parchment round. There we go. And that's then, a good point you can go if you were to miss any yeah. you can just go back in can't you You absolutely can and that is one of the key uh, features of your plate mate see at the moment i'm not stuck down i'm just because i'm only doing a little bit and then i'm rotating around but if i'm doing a larger bit normally and when i started the design i had the groovy tab so i was stuck onto the plate mate mm. so you can actually lift your parchment with the plate mate away ah. from your plate turn it around have a look, have a look. um and and then you, if you still need to sort of go back and change anything then you can line it back up without any any worries here we go so we're just going to put some of those in we don't need to put them all in just enough to okay i've got three four in oh do you know what i might as well do the last one might now yeah <laughs> that's the other thing we get carried away because it's relaxing oh it's heavy we get carried away and we just get into a a little zone I'm hoping that our lovely Linda Williams and Tina Cox are doing a little bit of um, groovy and relaxing at the moment as well because they're both um, under the weather. Um, so just send them a really, really big hug. I hope that they're feeling Let better soon. Let if you're watching just, and you're doing a little yeah, bit of parchment Indeed. Um, I reckon they probably are just sat maybe with their lamb sips and all that sort of thing with the, the blankies. Just keep warm and look after yourselves, rest up and come back to us soon. Aww. There we go. Right, so that is my frame in place. Gorgeous. Okay. Where do you want that? Where shall I show that? Uh, shall I give that to you? I'll pick it up. <laughs> there you go. So that's quite nice, isn't it? Yeah. Also, Gorgeous. I mean, that doesn't even have to be Christmas. We could leave the bauble off. We yep. could put something different in there, just a circle or something. This system enables you to make such mm. sophisticated cards, doesn't yes, it? Do you, it do you know what I mean? Does. Even if you're yeah. just starting and you're a newbie, yeah. you can produce, I mean, if producing a border like that, you'd think, oh, someone would have been doing it for years and years and there years. You go. But this yeah. system, you know, really, really helps. It really does. And the thing is, if you look at the, the um, ability level of the, the ladies on our design team as well, because we've got everything from ladies like Linda Williams herself and Glynis and uh, Josie and, you know, a few others, they've been doing this, they've been teaching this for a long time. They've mm. been doing it for 20 years. And yet also within the team, we've got people like Carol, Mrs. Pankey, we've got Sheila Bradley, we've got uh, Linda Page and, um, you know, and, and they didn't do any part before Groovy came along yeah. so it's a really good you know it is for everybody whatever your your level is at so okay. frames done for the moment so we're going to move on to this bit in the middle back layer all right mm -hmm. so um, we've got some lovely parchment pads all right which are oh called, we have they're nice, is this aren't they? Indian summer no this one is actually Shenandoah oh okay, which is quite right nice. so these are designed by the lovely Barbara they are um, and we've got some different we've got their parchment pads yeah. um, but different designs so we've actually got them on a pick a mix 463802 so you can choose any two they also come with a bonus folder which is worth 799 mm. Um, have you got one of those folders? Oh, I think you might um, have a folder. Do you want to see mine? Yes, please. There we go. Just because I think they're. Oh, thank you, you. So in there, I've got two. So, so at the spine, you can you can mark it so you know what's in there. So look, down the folder. Down the side. There we go. So yes. it's got it. So you know, it's parchment, and then I scribble on what designs are in there. So you're getting this folder included. Yep. 
so you can see all of your your designs so you can come in like so with this your, is the yeah, rainbow, rainbow river. river so you can mm -hmm. come in with you with your artwork and you can kind of you know you can look you can compare and say well which one do I, do yes. I want it's there they're all protected as well so they're not going to get dog-eared and they Isn't sit nicely on a, we like organization oh yeah yeah and you're getting that included so have a look on the website you can spread the cost to payment on flexi 24.98 pmp on your first payment um, and there's a variety variety of designs that you will see. We will look at them actually as we go down. I'll put, should I put that back? So yeah, can do. I just right think that fold is great. Yes, brilliant. Mm. Yeah, it keeps me organised. So what I've done then already, I've actually cut a piece. So I've used uh, one of our nested Pico. These are um, good. Fresh, yeah, they're yeah, lovely. They're, they're a game so changer. Good, they are, aren't they? Um, We're going to bring those up. We're always very, very busy. You can get sort of different shapes, squares, rectangles. Yeah. Uh, so these are your squares. Four zero six eight five one. 39.98 and your P and P, you get your matching groovy plate. They are phenomenal. Uh, we've also got the others on the website, so have a look because you can get your ovals, your circles, and your rectangles mm. as well. These really are fabulous. Whether you use just the plate on its own, whether you use just the dies on their own, mm. or whether you, you, you sort of use them in conjunction with each other. Right. So I've stuck down with a couple of tabs, giving this a rub with my tumble dryer sheet. Okay. And I'm going to come in and just do two sides to begin with, okay? So using your groovy garters here because it will hold your parchment nice and flat for you and just fly along those lines. Now also I've done an inner frame. Mm. So I think I have done this one here. Let me just, I always like to check, you know. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Um, <laughs> what I should do is actually lift the plate up and I can come in and check it like that, you see. That would be the logical oh, yeah, thing. So one, two, three, four. I think that's the fifth one. We're going to work with it. We're going to go for yeah. it. Here we go. So, uh, groovy guard. Here we go. So this one. There. Okay. And then I'm going to rotate it round. Now I can do the inner bit. I'm not doing the outside yet. You'll see why in a moment. There we go. I love the sound as well. Yeah, and when, I do. When you know that it's beautiful and mm. crisp and white underneath there. Right, let's do this side edge. Okay, so it's nice and easy. Now, the thing is, I've now got to get these two here, the sort of the top and the on the bottom. Yes. But I don't want to move these tabs, all right, because okay. I don't want to have to line these up. So before we move those, what we do is we take another two tabs and we put those down where we've already worked, okay? Because don't forget, in the pack of those, you're going to get 16 and they are reusable. So now my parchment is still stuck down, so it's now okay for me to take those ones away. <coughs> Here we go. So now I can do the other two sides. Here we go. Flip that around. Okay, so now what I've got is a really nice frame to work with. I do Lovely. sometimes sit with the with the different parchments and actually make these so that I've literally just got frames to work yeah, with. Because you idea. can put anything in there, can't mm. you? All right. So that's where we're up to. So now we want to um, fill this a little bit. So we're going to come back Before to. Before we do that, if you don't mind, I'm just yeah, going to have a little bit of a recap. Yes, yes absolutely, because we are busy. Let's have a look at the website because we did mention those Pico dies. Um, we can just have a look at those. So we've got your square, which is what Maria has used. We've also got your oval, your circle, and your rectangle as well. So have a look at those on the website. You can see some great reviews as well. They're always very, very popular whenever we show them here at Hachanda. Okay, let's talk about our one day special. Um, so these are brand new today. So these are the groovy plates designed by Cherry Green. You've seen the stamps before. You absolutely love them. We're now bringing you the plates. So we wish you Christmas by Cherry Green over 
20% of the stock has gone. You're getting five of the A6 plates and then you're also getting 10 sheets of A4 parchment sheets in your cranberry and your green for just 29.95 and your PMP. So you save 10 pound on this one day special. These are so intricate, pretty. Um, they're very cool as well. A little bit different, not just for Christmas at all. Yes, there's some Christmas bits and pieces on there, but it can be for all year round. And I'll show you a few um, samples. So there's one that's by Emma. So wishing you health, wealth and happiness. And then another one by Emma again, actually. We wish you a Merry Christmas. It's just something a little bit different. And then we've got this one. That's by Carol, our Mrs. Panky. You can do, can you imagine how much you can do when you get these home? And particularly, of course, if you did purchase the stamps as well while we had those on. That's by Josie Davidson. So again, not for Christmas at all. That could be for all year round. Oh, and a stunning one here. So this one is by Josie again. Look, isn't that gorgeous? We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. So 037732 is your item number, 29.95. That is for your one day special. You're saving 10 pound, but this offer is only valid for 24 hours or until stocks last. And we're already a quarter of the stock gone of your one day special. So be quick with that. Now, something else we need to tell you, and the reason this is on the show is because they actually fit, this um, starter kit will fit the uh, size of your one day special. This is your Groovy Go mini starter kit. So you get your plate mate, your A6 plates, your mat, your parchment, your tools, and your accessories for the unbelievable price of just $29.94 and your PMP. This is something that I own, so I do this at home uh, myself for enjoyment and my son does it as well who's six because um, as Maria said if you can hold a pen then you can use this system so it's going to make it very very easy for you you've got ideas in here you've got your parchment you've got your tools but as Maria was saying earlier the plates that you're getting in the one day special will fit perfectly within this plate mate so if you're new maybe to Groovy then this would be the ideal kit to go for if you're wanting to get the one day special you you're going to be very, very busy with all that these two have to offer. 495 443 29.94 and your PMP. You save six pounds. It's a brilliant kit. You'll be thrilled with this as well. And of course, portable, you can take it on the go. Let's have a look at those stamps because, of course, the stamps you have already seen and you loved as well. So the stamps 515 998. You get 18 stamps in total. They're beautiful. 39.96 and your PMP. Again, not just for Christmas you can use them all year round and um, they're really intricate really really pretty and as well you are getting a color guide as well so if you fancy coloring but you're not that confident in your coloring don't worry because she has provided um, Cherry has provided a coloring guide as well 39.96 in your PMP and you get a freedom price on these as well 35.96 so we're back with our lovely Maria Okay, right, so I'm uh, just making a start. Um, so we've gone on to the text plate now. So I'm just going to put some, some text above and below. So what we want is the, the we wish show. So that's quite sort of clever, isn't it? Yeah, I you love like that. that. There we mm -hmm. go. Of course, if you don't like that and you want to do I wish you, if you look further down, you've got a U, we've got uh, a Y, uh, we've got all the letters in there. So you could change it. We could put we wish you if you're going to use this plate with your other Christmas designs as well. Not a problem. Really nice and easy to do. Okay. Right. So again, we're just going to glide around. And what I always say to people here is because this is quite sort of intricate, just slow these bits down. You find that you can just fly around larger designs. But when you get sort of smaller detail, just slow yourself down. Remember, we're relaxing here. Mm, it's not yes. a race. Okay. No. We're just enjoying the, the, the process. Here we go. So we wish you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Lovely jubbly. 
okay and then what I would do down at the bottom I would re now if I'm unsure if I've got all of this or if it's clear enough then we were talking about the plate made earlier on mm. so what we can do is then lift this away so that we can turn it over and we can have a little look and we can check have we got everything on there that we need is it clear enough um, and then when we pop this back Perfect. down it's in exactly the same place so you're not going to get tram lines you know mm. all right be difficult to line up so I'm going to move this up here so we would put a Merry Christmas okay so let's pretend we put the Merry Christmas in okay right? let's move on to the shoes yeah so again so let's just lift this out and so we're going with the kind of the, the strappy sandaly um, shoe. This is this is really really nice. So pretty. There there's go. shoes, there's boots, and as well, there's mm -hmm. a lot more. So you've got your Christmas baubles, your yeah. garlands, you've got feathers. There's feathers. There's all love. sorts of, of yeah. stuff. There's bows. There's, uh, there's, so there's much. holly. Um, there's oh yeah. There's just it's a really lovely uh, collection. It is, isn't it? Right. So let's have a little look over here. So I'm going to come over like about there okay that'll do because I also want some space for my baubles as well you see okay so I'm gonna come in with the shoe where's my groovy guard here it is <laughs> so now you'll notice I've come up past um, the yes. lettering that's okay because I've done it on the finished piece as well all right that's okay because I wanted this I wanted the angle of the shoe okay. um, and that's why I put the wording in first okay so I have done that deliberate don't worry there we go. So just glide around the shoe. Lovely, jubbly. It's a nice one to decoupage this one as well because mm. you've got that, you know, the strappy uh, piece across there as well. There we go. So those little bits just fly across there like so. And then your feathers. Also, if you wanted to, you could change the design on here just because we've given you feathers within this sandal doesn't yeah. mean you've got to use those you could do grid work in there and tomorrow i'm going to ah. do a little bit of that um when we're going to have a nice relaxing couple of hours nine o'clock and one o'clock we're just going to work on, on one nice piece of techniques oh, um, lovely. you could take one of the designs from the other shoes if you want you could put um holly in there you could put flowers from if you if you've got the groovy go uh, set and you've got Tina's doodles. Yes. You oh, could use elements yeah, from there. Yeah, there's so many lovely um, yeah. doodles on that. There are <laughs> indeed. Right, here we go. Almost there. Let's just get all those ditty bits and then just. You'll across. notice as well how quickly Maria is producing this card. And that is really because of that, that system is enabling you because you're very, very, you know, if you, in sort of old parchment style, mm -hmm. if you're going to be drawing that shoe yeah. and those feathers. I wouldn't have got very far. No. <laughs> yeah. no. Yeah, it would take an awful lot longer. That's one of the key features um, about the, the system. But again, we're not taking anything away from traditional techniques. We still want to encourage people to do oh, those yeah. as well. We're just giving you the, the first sort of stage. Right, so let's have a little look. Let's turn this over. So that's our first shoe in place there, wow. okay? So um, now the other one on the finished piece is actually decoupaged on, so we don't need to worry about that for the moment. But I do want to get a couple of the baubles because I want to show how to colour those as well. Oh, yes. Yeah. So uh, I'm going to come in, and I changed this uh, a little bit as well. So let me see what I did here. So about here, because remember on the finished piece, I've got letters mm. along here as well, okay? So that's about right, I think. We can always change the plan anyway, should we decide to. And then let's get some baubles in place. There we go. I like these ones because they're empty. So again, we could change those. We could put a design in them or just leave them as they are if we, we want to. They're nice to colour. Mm. This is go. such a lovely project to get home. Even if it's, it doesn't have to be for doing all your Christmas cards. Maybe mm -hmm. you adore shoes or you just fancy, you know, having a go at parchment with the groovy system. This is a lovely way to get these plates home, you know, mm -hmm. maybe get the groovy go system and give it a try. It's so enjoyable. Yeah, for sure. It really is very, uh, very relaxing. And I should say, you know, anybody, if you can hold a pan, mm. then you can, you can do groovy. There we go. And also the Groovy Go as well, the price point on that one makes that quite a nice um, gift as well. Yes, it does. There we go. A couple more bits there. And then we're going to 
Okay, so baubles are in place. So um, we're going to come away from the plates now for the moment. Okay. okay, so I'm going to turn my light panel off. I'm going to pop that over there and I'm going to bring in, cover that over with a mat. So at the moment then what we've got is the frame okay which is the top layer mm -hmm. and we've got the the colored parchment here as well Gorgeous. all right so things to do now firstly i want to give those baubles just a tiny little bit of life yes i okay. want you to color that because <coughs> i um want to know how you do it okie dokie well first of all <laughs> just a tiny little bit of movement so i've got my pink excellent embossing mat here or if you are if you've got one of the starter kits yes. then you would use your black mat the foam side yep. of, your, of your black okay. mat okay so i'm going to use my not 0.5 uh, tool here and all I'm going to do with this literally is just a, is that the right one um, yeah it is so no that looks smaller I put my tool in the wrong place it's all right I'm having a moment I thought that's not right <laughs> there you go I'd end up putting that through the parchment okay so what I'm going to do is kind of give that a little flick like that okay and then this one and this is just so it will look like the the light so this is, is where you're it. kind of going freehand yes right I am. okay yeah okay because we can do that as well mm. you know you can change your design yeah. so what that's done there now so this is going to look when it's colored like the light is hitting it like there you know those glossy baubles yes. yeah okay i stay away from those ones because i drop them and break them do you yeah i do yeah <laughs> okay so then on the bauble we've got these little white areas here well they're going to be white there we go so i'm just going to come in just gently again with my one 1.5 tool side by side and just now at home I wouldn't make these quite so um, white um, I would do them just part way let them rest and come back and make them really white tomorrow but just so they're nice and visible will the tools in the starter kit and the go the groovy go starter kit will they be okay yes. to be able to do this with yes okay. they will again um the the instructions will guide you through yeah. which tool to use for which process brilliant um also if you get stuck which you shouldn't do you know the, the instructions are really comprehensive they really and concise are there's and pictures it's yeah. really clear yeah um but come and find us on facebook we've got a couple of groups so we've got um, uh, groovy worldwide and um, we've got clarity worldwide as well and there is also always plenty of people on there like-minded there's team members that can answer questions yeah. for you and share um, and so much inspiration whenever yeah. i see that things coming up and i just yeah. think oh just it's nice it. isn't it okay so i've just added a little bit of white here uh, a little bit on the the shoe on that here amazing okay so then now also what i've done is i have done another shoe separately here okay, okay. Um, so this one and it's darker in color i wanted this one to kind of really sort of stand out as well um, so we've got that one that we can work on now because this is quite dark i actually want it dark i've specifically gone in um to to the dark area but if i wanted to add some light on here what oh, i yeah. can do is actually remove color all right okay. so how we would do that is let's say for example i wanted to add some yellow into the color yeah well yellow isn't going to show up over dark blue is it no so what we do is we take uh, a pencil eraser okay so oh that could do a bit of a sharpen and then we come in on the colored side which is the darker side yeah we'll do it here because i actually don't want to take any color out of, out okay. of this shoe but i'll just sort of demonstrate the the idea there we go so what we do there is rub with the eraser and then it takes the color out so from that side now so now if i for example mm. if i grab my do you uh, mean a reg just a regular eraser yeah well or? there's different erasers out there so try i mean i've got a double-ended one it's pink on one end and it's white on the other okay some erasers are better than others so just try what you've got so now for example if i come in here and color there but if i color an area next yeah, to it as well of course. yeah so from the front you can now see where I've removed the colour, but you can't where I haven't. So that's a good thing to do. Get yourself yeah. a, a nice eraser yes. so you can take colour out. Okay? Yes. So, bit of colour in then. Mm. Uh, so this is where it's important now to be on a solid mat. So this is where your mat that comes in, whichever starter kit you've got, comes in handy. And I'm still using mine from the starter kit, even though I'm using Pergamano tools as well. So we want the solid side 
for our colouring. All right, so what have we got? We've got our frame and we've got our shoes and baubles as well. So let's have a little look. And I'm going to use my Perga uh, colour pens because okay. I wanted more vibrant colour. If I want sort of more pastel-y, then I would use my Perga liner pencils. Okay. If I want bold, then I would go for, for my pens. Pens. Okay, so. so both we do have on the website. Mm -hmm. We'll bring up the um, Perga colours for you now. There we go. Right, uh, let's see. I'm just grabbing a couple of the colours that I know I want to use. There They're coming go. in a moment. Just are they on the way? <laughs> oh, they are. Right, 339657. So these are your Perga colours. So this is what you're going to be using, yeah, the markers. Yeah. So 30 of them. They're water-based markers, 2594 and your PMP. Yeah, lovely. Right, OK, so let's just do a little bauble for now. If I bring in the finished piece, OK, so and if you have a look at the bauble, so what we've got is this kind of graduated um, colour there, so from dark to light so we've got various ways of doing that you can blend the pens on their actual nibs or you can lay the color down and then blend with a lighter color or you can come in with I like to use this is a, a clear sparkle pen Ooh. all right and you can actually uh, blend with that as well so um, but I'm gonna do this I'm gonna undo, do it with the pens okay? okay so first of all I'm gonna lay down in the sort of the darkest area here I'm gonna just lay down a little bit of my darker green and then I'm going to come in with my yellow I'm going to put yellow up here first are and these just designed to be used on parchment no absolutely oh, not okay. I use these on on all sorts okay. right so now what I'm going to do here I'm going to kind of introduce the colors like that okay mm -hmm. and drag the darker color up into the lighter color okay and then we get this blend start to happen so that will start to blend them okay oh, wow. now if you're worried about the nib of my my lighter color yeah. it's not a problem because look it will come right back to the pale color again so mm. don't worry about contaminating your pens oh, doing brilliant. that it's absolutely mm -hmm. fine okay so we can do that just realize i've got the yo wrong yellow i've got the yoki yellow so let me just grab the correct one that's better there we go um 30 colors in that set that they, they're brilliant yeah. they really are um so now i want to have a little go at these baubles so on those then i'm going to come in now with the pencil uh eraser because i am going to put some lighter in this uh the top of this bauble okay so i'm going to come in and just remove i don't need to remove a lot of color and only kind of towards the top so i'm not going to go sort of crazy but i can just give it a wedge over it give the pens a little bit of tooth to stick to as well okay but in, in answer to your question about the pens mm. i use them on my regular um sort of stamping um journaling oh, um, so okay. forth. yeah they're really nice too and there's lots of different ways of using them to blend and, and color in right here we go so what i want then is uh, let's do one of these blue uh, baubles down here so down at the bottom i want the nice sort of the darker color so I'm going to give it a curve like so and then I'm going to come in with a lighter colour and again I'm going to put the lighter colour in up here first of all, let those just meet and then I'm going to drag the darker colour, just little circling movements into the lighter colour like so. so from, the, from the other side you'll see how nice mm. that is. Let's go on this middle one with the green. So again let's follow the curve like so and I am working on the back because for one thing it's far more forgiving I haven't got really got to worry about uh, staying away from lines and that sort of thing because from the front mm. the white lines will still be dominant okay okay so same again I'm now putting my lighter color in and then I'm going to drag the darker into the light now I've got a little bit much so what I want to do is just come over here mm -hmm. scrap area and just let me bring that in so you can see what I'm doing. So I'm just getting rid of that green. Yeah. Go back to my yellow. And again, just kind of, so it's not all green. There we go. And just, so again, get rid of a little bit of that green. And just blend that in. Like so. There we go. Lovely. So then from the front, and it's as this dries yes. actually. Let so me put good. something sort of lighter underneath. There you go. Can you see? Sort of a glass effect. Isn't yeah, it? that's right. So just remember, underneath would be where your darker is, and then on the top is where the, where the light would be. 
So that's oh, your baubles. That's so good. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Um, what? How are we for time? What have we got left? We've got about eight minutes. Okay. No worries. So um, that's what I would do with all the baubles. Yeah. And I would do it on this frame as well. Yeah. Okay. Let me do one of these little ribbons on here. So on this then. Oh, hello. So go in my dark blue. So let's just put. So these markers are at the bottom of the screen, 339657, you're getting 30 of them for 25.94 and your PMP and not just for use on parchment either. Right, so again, I'm just literally dragging the darker colour into the middle and just literally just blend that like so. Mm. Okay, and again, you can get rid of the dark and it will come back to its colour, please don't worry about that. Okay, so Do you know what I love about you? Go on. I always think you answer every question that anyone might have before it, it's, it would okay. even... Do you know what I mean? She's so good I, at saying... I try to. Because that was exactly what I was thinking. When you were using that and it went into the dark, I thought, but that's going to stay in the tip. But before I could yeah. almost even have that thought, she says, now, if you're worried about this... <laughs> if you're, I, feel sort of think, I feel like, yeah, she's amazing. I feel like every question is answered. Well, it's nice to... It's to lovely. I, I still try to think about when I first started crafting yeah. and the beauty of her chander is, you know, we can reach new people that maybe are isolated with their crafting and haven't actually got anyone to yeah. ask. So I still kind of um you know think in in that way so on the this piece i don't think here, there's anything you don't know really about oh, it no I, I, I believe there'll be plenty <laughs> i don't know but you know if i don't know i yeah. might know somebody that will know yeah. and i'll certainly <laughs> try handy. and find out <laughs> there you go so this time i'm coming in from the front and i'll tell you why because the yellow is going to really ping but also because it's only yellow and i haven't got to be as careful with the white line if this was dark blue i would be a whole lot more careful because it could look scruffy if I end up on those white lines okay, okay? but you can see the yellow is just popping mm. there as it does on the on the finished yes. piece okay so we've done a little bit of white mm -hmm. uh, we've created the design we've done a little bit of color um, what about a little bit of perforating a little bit yeah. of yeah oh yes or how are we for we're gonna be okay to do the bit of that yeah We've got six minutes. Okay. We can show a little yeah, bit, can't we? I'm just going to show yeah, you this card. This is what we're. Um, we'll, we we finish this. Do you think in the eight? We could do. do. We'll still we could do. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So that's. Are. Yeah. Let's do a bit of perforating okay. because I think that's good to see, don't you? Yeah. We could mm. do that, and then what we could do is we could do we could concentrate on the other shoe later on. Yes. Let's sort out the frame for the moment, mm. and then do the other shoe later. Yeah. Yeah. Okie dokie, cool. And then you're going to show how to decoupage? Yeah, I'll do that. I'll show That's you how, to st how I stick it down as well because it's yes. one of the things that we're asked all the time. How do you stick things down? That's so exactly yeah, I what will, I was yeah, wanting to know. Yeah, I will show that, not a problem. Right, so Ooh, let's look eight at the... Eight o'clock. So I'll be on my way home then and then I'll get will home you? and watch it. I'll and catch learn. up. Yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. Right, I'll give you a wave. <laughs> <laughs> right, here we go. So let's go back to the light panel. Again, this isn't essential, but it's, um, you know, for anybody that sort of struggles with their, their eyes, you know, this is, oh, hello, oh, God, I was going to say, I'm going to give me electric a kick down yeah. on the floor there. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Bit of panicky moment there. Right, so what I need now is a two needle bold, okay, Pergamano tool. All right, so these are quite nice. And I'm going to use my groovy guard. Now, the reason that I'm going to use a two needle is because when we get this this pico edge yep. on here, all right, the foundations of those is getting your holes right. And one of those things, one of those elements of getting the holes right is the spacing in between the perforations. Yeah. So by using a two needle uh, bowl tool and only doing one fresh hole at a time, it means that the distance between the holes is absolutely uniform. Okay. All right. So I'm going to start in this corner then, um, and I'm paraphrasing on the inside of my frame. If I wanted this to be a whole piece and I wanted to preserve this piece in the middle here, mm. okay, I would be paraphrasing on the outside of my design. So I would have a big piece. But what I want is this as an aperture. So okay. I'm paraphrasing on, on the inside. Okay. So the tool needs to be nice and upright. Okay, and I'm just going to perforate like so. I'm going to move on to one of my smaller holes. This is good. Again, this is great because it holds the parchment mm. down for you to stop it coming up and down and up and down and warping it. So I've started, I've got my first two holes. So I'm now going to put my, my tool in the last hole and I'm going to continue. Now, one of the things is 
that you might maybe your eyes are or you know not so good or maybe yeah. you're in shade so what you can do and sometimes it's handy you can come in at an angle and kind of hook your hole all right yes. your, your perforation all right so you can kind of locate it but then it's important to then bring your tool upright before you actually then perforate well okay? that's a good tip so it is and then just follow your shape around now i'm close to the white line but i'm not on the white line okay so you just work your way around whatever shape that it is. I know we're running out of time but just mm. to let you know that Maria is going to be back at eight o'clock where she is going to uh, continue with this and I show will. you some more as well some decoupage uh -huh. lots more tips and also in the next 24 hours as well you're going to see some really lovely things in the shows that she's going to do. Yeah. Let's have a little look at our website you can find all the tools that Maria is using um, on the website. So everything that's featured in this show, you can find on our website. So the Pergamano tools, the markers, also those papers as well that you've seen Maria using. And um, we've got the papers on the website, everything. Everything you could possibly need if this is a journey that you're thinking you'd like to start on. Um, and I definitely would recommend a starter kit, whether it be the Groovy Go, all the starting it if, if you're new to it then i highly recommend that mm -hmm. but let's just finish with our one day special over 30 percent of the stock of this has gone these are your we wish shoe christmas by cherry green um, you are getting five of the a6 plates the groovy plates the 10 of the a4 parchment sheet so you get five in your cranberry five in your green for just 29.95 in your pmp so your saving will be 10 pounds and also as we were saying earlier, yes, there's shoes, there's boots, but there's an awful lot more, isn't there? Mm, yeah, there absolutely there's feathers, is. There's feathers, there's baubles, there is. We've there's got holly. borders, we've got accents, we've got embellishments. Uh, just mix it all up. And they're, the beautiful sentiments as well. Yeah, they're jam-packed, really, mm. aren't they? Yeah. I mean, that's you can see what you're getting now. Those are the sort of sentiments you're getting, the flourishes, the shoes, the boots. Um, have we got time to show a couple of samples? You're right, let's show a few samples. That's lovely, isn't it, from Josie? Yeah. Really nice. So Josie has decoupage there. So she's done her first shoe within her frame and then she's added another one on, similar to, to what I'm going to do at the, the 8 o'clock show. There we go, just one shoe here. So this is Emma, Emma Burns. So you can see here, Emma, same, you know, she's built up a, a lovely frame using the kind of, um, you know, just a long sort of element. What would we call that? Long uh, panel uh, strip? Yeah, strip. strip. Yeah, does, yeah. Or panel. Um, yeah. Mm. There we go. And then this one's Jane. Oh. And again, so now imagine this, take those words away. Yes. Okay, and put a happy birthday or something in there. Exactly. Yeah. exactly that's what i love about this it really is full year round yeah i know we're coming to the end i just want to try and show a few that we've not seen <laughs> this that's is sheila. sheila yeah that's stunning isn't it lovely i love that and i love all the color in that yeah, i must admit beautiful mm. and that one, one. karen lovely yeah. karen this is cool so karen has taken those tiny little baubles from different various elements within the plates and dangled them from the text really gorgeous now wait till you see this Glynis, oh, yeah, isn't that stunning? That. Yeah, grid work. Oh, and you're going to be, are you going to show any grid work I am going to do, next 20 a yeah, I am just, but a bite-sized bit for anybody that's nervous, just Ooh, a bite-sized bit. Oh, how exciting. So, you're going to yeah. learn a lot, actually, from Maria over the next 24 hours in these shows. Thank you so Thank much. You. I've learned a lot, which I'm thrilled <laughs> cool. about. Thank you to you at home. A wonderful one-day special by Clarity, as always.